right in the store. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Way to get to like get, get an audience on my side. No, no, no. Yeah. So I make that call for the quarantine and the pilot. Yeah, very yeah. early on the show. I'm yeah. the guy who does it. It's really stressful. Yeah. And, I, and I'm stuck there, writing like near like, ground zero, patient zero. And there's a lot of stress, and I'm trying to hide that stress to my basically. Because people are looking to me to, for answers, and, and it, I'm freaking out inside. But I have to hide it. So. <laughs> It's not. It's, 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 for me, it's not about being a hero. Or, you know, it's, it's it's just doing my job as much as I can. And and um, and it's it's what. And I know people are looking to me for some like, what does this mean? What, what's going on? Why is why is it happening so quickly? This virus, which can actually happen. So I, sometimes I don't have all the answers as my character, but at the same time I can't go. I don't know. Because <laughs> maybe you, maybe halfway through the show I just do. I don't know. <laughs> but um, but look, you will see, you will see how the characters develop. With it's not predictable. You don't know how people react in these situations. So when there's pressure cooker, that is a containment and outside as well. What happens to you when this happens to you? And I love the way we ask the audience this. So, yeah. Do you think that your character agrees with Dr. Lerman's decision? Uh, for decision four? Well, because the, the, the reporting was more yeah, cool, yeah. but I get the effect that she's going to do a little bit above and beyond. Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I, 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 we always, you know, I always try and disseminate the information to all the Black's characters, as you, as you say. So it's a question of when, when times like this, when everything hits the fan, you know, you've got to sort of try and get some protocol and try and um, try and sort of have a structure of people to listen to and who to who to take orders from. Um, will there be a mutiny? Will there be some kind of something like that to that effect from any of the characters? We don't know. We'll have to find out. It, we can't, you know, we don't know what's going to happen because it, it's so, that's all like, the show is so honest about what you would do in a situation. It's a, almost controlled chaos, trying to control chaos, really. It seems like the character very much is, you know, a scientist and he wants to do his job and find a cure or something to help, um, but you kind of keep having to confront humanity and how they're reacting to this virus. Can you talk about that a little bit? So, what, the humanity versus the scientific mm -hmm. side of the mm -hmm. brain. So. Yeah. Well, that, that, that is more like how I, like for how other people are reacting to my character. Yeah, I mean, again, again it, it's people looking for answers, really. That's what, like, that's kind of, it, especially early on in the show, well, throughout, really, is like, what's going on, what's coming on, what's this going on, what does this mean? And, and I'm afraid, I'm scared, I, as in they're telling me I'm afraid, but I'm scared as well. But you, ha when you, you don't tell, when you tell your doctor something, you don't want your doctor to go, oh god, <laughs> <laughs> seriously, is that, oh my god, and you really, and, and you look surprised, you look freaked out, you don't want that to happen, you go to another doctor for that, happens. so yeah, so, so you try and, he's had that doctor patient mentality, but he's, he's also seen it to a degree, he's done his research, he's done his epidemic training, uh, but he's never done it at this scale. And he has to step up to the plate in a way, but not in that sort of heroic way, which you'll see other characters maybe do, or maybe, maybe he can do, I don't know. But um, it's just in the way he knows, or the way he's been trained for, and you try and do the best you can in such a crisis. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you so much. No problem. <laughs>